Halo Country is brought to you by Realtree, family, friends, and the outdoors. Lizard's Bar and Grill, Nashville and Las Vegas. Gator Waiters, designed to fit and built to last. Ren and Ivy, leave a legacy. Kent Cartridge, high performance precision ammo. And these other fine sponsors. When we always went out west, every year we'd go out there for the World Championship duck calling competition and we'd always get there on a Friday and there was absolutely nothing to do for the past, I don't know, 10 years. We thought it would be cool to introduce something that gave, I don't know, everybody something to look forward to. I'm actually going to play a concert at a little bar and grill called Wildlife. Uh, first time with Stuck Guard, first time to Max Prairie Wings, and uh, first time with the Wildlife Bar and Grill. So a duck hunting trip like this takes a lot of, you know, Guns, shells, decoys, you know, mojos, camouflage, everything else, and you know, we're we're sitting there and we're making sure we got everything going through the checklist. Of we didn't get probably I don't know 35 miles outside of Oxford. Sometimes I gotta I gotta take Riley under my wing a little bit, and I'm like, hey man, did you bring your hunting socks? Yeah. Did you bring your gun? He was like, yeah. He was like, I said, did you bring your shells? He was like, check. I was like. Did you bring your guitar? And he was like, I didn't bring my guitar. And I was like, you didn't bring your guitar? You're coming to play a concert, dude. You're coming to play a concert. I'm going to play a show in Arkansas. I forgot, I forgot our guitar, so here we are. We'll let Greg peek. Just close your eyes and point at one. Oh. Look at the price tag first. <laughs> Be a little careful, that top row up there. Okay. We stopped at uh, Bailey Brothers uh, off 280 right there in Birmingham. And and actually pick out a guitar for myself, which would have been a lot easier task had Greg not been with me. This one looked good. <laughs> it fits your hands perfectly. <laughs> he managed to make everything a little bit difficult. Don't get nothing pink and nothing will fly over. I can't make any promises. <laughs> pink sounds like, hey, this is nice. This is mauve. It was either this or pink, but that's Thank probably the best. Call. That hurt a lot. <laughs> That's all my birthday money. <laughs> well, when we rolled into Stuttgart, just just like always, the, one of the first things you do is you go by Max Prairie Wings. When we get to Max Prairie Wings, which you know is like a Toys R Us for grown-ups, and uh, I get to meet uh, Brad Allen, who's uh, you know, elite duck calls, and uh, you know, that's an honor anyway, because he's a professional duck caller, and Chase Camp, Greg's brother, was down there, and uh, <clears throat> Brad gives me a duck call, which is really cool, you know, I've, uh, anything freeze great, but a elite duck call like that, it's a great call, and uh, we chatted for a little while, and me and Don and some of the guys slip off kind of to the side, and I start looking around. I got a gift card to Max Perry when first time down there, there, and I find me this just jacket thing. I just never seen one like it. You know, it's got like ducks and deer heads on it, which is right up my alley. Oh, it's not too hot. I'm gonna rock this all day. This right here. Take like we just met. You don't even know me. You know, of course, Don's mom. He, he wears all my clothes, so I figured he might as well be a good one to ask if it looked okay. You know, so we're trying on everything, and I got this jacket. I mean, I think it was a, you know, it was a, it was a diamond in the rough in that place, man. It was a fine. So eighty-five bucks, man. I can buy a jacket. Wear this all day forever. That night we got out there and we were hanging out and we heard the crowd out there and, and it was a small intimate group. We're hanging out and we get in the, I guess green room in the back and uh, you know, me and Greg are back there and I start playing around a little bit on the guitar and sure enough Greg finds some way to act like an idiot. He starts freestyle singing on this song. And, uh, You know, 
it, that kicks the night off. Greg basically opened the show for me in the back room, you know, just making stuff up. And, uh, you know, he just he gets, in, gets in the moment. I guess he feels like he's got it that night. So he's up on the stage with me for too long. <laughs> sitting in a chair and he's kind of just, you know, the random old guy up there on the stage with him, you know, so uh, Greg finds a way to be weird and he, he did it again that night, so nobody complained about it. I can just assume I bring a guy with me and he sits on the stage and doesn't do anything the whole time, so he added to the show, I'm sure. These moments of field are precious. You worked hard all year to be here. You strive to live a life without compromise. Proud of our hunting heritage, rooted in the traditions and ethics of the sporting lifestyle. Wren and Ivy, leave a legacy. About halfway through the concert, as good as Riley was doing, all I could really think about was getting in the duck blind the next morning. I was excited. I mean, it's one of those mornings where you could hear the ducks quack and you could hear them on the water. We got ducks literally landing in our spread before the sun even comes up. So, you know, we're sitting there and that's one of those tough things to do. I know everybody experienced that. Shooting light's not in yet and you know, you're just shaking, ready to, ready to shoot, especially when you got ducks coming in. But we had ducks, I mean, literally just swarming us. But one group of four mallards started working. I mean, right one minute after, after shooting light and they all worked in. And as soon as they got there, we got the shot called and boom, 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 all four of them came in and went down. We had a you know, great start in the morning. Uh, everybody was shooting. Uh, we killed several of that first group we got to shoot at. And uh, you know those greenheads kept working in and we eventually had some teal come in and that was one of those things where you know, you had several passes thinking this is the one, this is the time to shoot, whatever. So it was one of those fun. They worked like they were supposed to that morning. And Ducks. Seeing that dog work and run out there and pick those ducks up and the sun just kind of, you know, coming up, it was a, that's one of my favorite things about duck hunting is, is just being out there and seeing how pretty it is like that. You shooting down? Oh yeah. You're just standing there. <laughs> <laughs> I saw you shoot, so that's good enough. Did it look like a good shot? No, Mr. Greg, he knocked the feathers out once. He said Mr. Greg's not a very good shot. <laughs> he said Mr. Greg hit everything. When you, were, when you weren't looking, he was like, he hit everything. My first trip to Stuttgart, first trip to Max Prairie Wings, first time playing out there, and uh, you know, first time hunting with Brett and those guys, meeting Brad Allen, it was, a, it was a great trip overall. You know, Don getting to come out there, had a great time, his first duck hunt, and uh, everything came together like it was supposed to, which doesn't always happen in a duck hunt, so you know, I, I can't wait for you know, the next trip out here. I can't wait to come back to Stuttgart, and we had a great time. Halo Country is brought to you by Real Tree, family, friends, and the outdoors. Lizard's Bar and Grill, Nashville and Las Vegas. Gator Waiters, designed to fit and built to last. Ren and Ivy, leave a legacy. Kent Cartridge, high performance precision ammo. And these other fine sponsors. That's like, that's like you just make me so mad, my granddad say, I asked him how far something is, he say, well, as a crow flies, it's like this. I'm like, granddad, I'm not gonna ride on the back of a crow there. I need to know how far it is in distance. You see a pintail, literally, hide everybody's gun except mine. 
If you see, if you see a hooded merger, make the sound of a chipmunk. <laughs>